What's up guys, it is John, I'm back with another What's up guys, it is John, I'm back with another There's an owl. I'm back with another adventure, guys. I got my boy Tim. Show you. We're breaking the show, and guys, we're at the Red Ash Cemetery. Now, this is deemed one of the top 10 most haunted places in Tennessee, guys, and we're going to check it out. So follow us. All right, guys, I'm going to turn night vision on here so you can see more. Now, there's some, a lot of stories here. They see a lady here, but the scariest thing, because a lot of the demonic uh, worship that goes on here, they say at one of these graves, and we're going to go to it in a minute, that a half goat, half man, demon looking creature will chase you out of here at night. We're going to find out. I think they do it because it's so isolated out here. Yeah, it, this is so isolated, guys. We're far away from anything. And we're going to check it out, guys. Down here at the bottom of the hill, of all places. This one caught my attention. I hate seeing the ones with the little lamb on them. 1924. Well, usually this is a multi sided stone when they do these. No, it's just this got one person. Yeah, just like one. a lot of times you'll see like person yeah. on each side of it buried. No, just that one. And it's kind of overgrown a little bit, guys. I mean, somebody obviously comes in here some ever so often and cuts it down, but it's not a very well maintained cemetery. I mean, it's far away from anything. Yeah, you see the little lamb on top of them. Yeah. You know it's it's early 1900s, late 1800s, and it's a child. And unfortunately, I'm seeing a lot of them here. A ton, yeah. More than I've seen in any other cemetery. I've only seen it in one other cemetery, but the size was so much bigger that you had no choice but to. So many headstones guys, scattered around. Like a one, These are old ones here. Maybe you guys go to the other side to read them. No, Can't even make that one out. This is well over a hundred year old cemetery, guys. Looks like bones over there. It was a statue. Oh. All up. Yeah, that headstone seen better days. Yeah, I thought it was a headstone. I don't think it is. Is there somebody down there? It looks like somebody standing there. No, no, it's a statue. Oh, okay. <laughs> that is where you see the demon, because they say there's a statue of a woman with blonde hair that's been painted. That's the only statue. And that's a they say it's the only one here. There used to be a gate, like a little fence around it. What's really weird though, you look, all of these are pretty much together. This one is standing by itself. Yeah, and that's where a lot of the activity, they say it's the oldest part is down here. Okay, and they say that's where you see the figure come from. There used to be a fence around this with a gate. The fact that this one sits all alone has really got me kind of weirded out. Like, this is there is no other headstones anywhere over here. I say there used to be a bunch down here. Let's go check it out. I don't see them. No, like from spicy. what from what I read, down here was where a lot of the slaves were buried, so they'd probably be unmarked anyways. I've been smell weird things out here, dude. Yeah. That smells like a Carolina Reaper pepper. Is that weird? Oh wait, what's this? That's a newer one. 
Oh, here's the old one. Look at that statue, man. 1933 to 1999. It's not even that old. These spiders are fighting or mating. Really? Yeah. This statue is creepy, man. Let's get a look at this. Oh, I see the spiders. Oh, I do see that leaf got me. I do see some headstones over here. There's a third one over here ready to take his turn. <laughs> Yeah, there's some headstones here, man. Is there? They're just stones. They're actually all over the place. Oh, crap. You know what this reminds me of? What's that? These remind me of the stones by the little cemetery by my house. Yeah. The single headstone cemetery? Mm-hmm. That's what these remind me of. Now, you said these were probably the slaves? Yeah, they said there were slaves buried in here originally. This was originally a slave cemetery. Oh yeah, and you're stepping on one right there. Oh, wow. I wonder, with those headstones, the way they look, those are identical to the ones by my house. I wonder if it was slaves buried there too. All right, guys, we're gonna set a spirit box up here because they say this is where the crazy activity happens. So we're gonna set up spirit box and do a little bit of spirit box session. Yeah. I decided I'm gonna set it right here. I'm gonna turn it on. Make sure my volume is up. All right. Okay, if there's anyone here with us, we set this device here for you to communicate with us. Would you like to tell us anything? Can you start by telling us your name? Can you tell us how long you've been here? All right, so we're, if there's anyone here with us, let us know your name. Sounds like something trying to come through. I know. Is there more than one of you here? How long have you been here? We've got this device here for you. Feel free to use it to communicate with us. Can you tell us your name? Oh, do you hear that? Sound like I said, uh-uh. Yeah. Dude, that was That was really creepy, man. I know, I hope that caught it on audio. I do too. Guys, let me know if you heard that. That was crazy. Thank you for communicating with us. I need to us. get a better speaker. Yeah, you do, man. Well, since you know how to use it, can you tell me your name? Okay, guys, I just don't think there's a signal enough here for Spirit Box to actually function. So we're just going to stand here and ask a few questions, see if we get anything yeah, out of we're it. We're not getting anything from this. And maybe walk back out and just kind of see what happens. Is there anyone out here with us? Is there anybody here that would like to speak with us? My camera went really blurry. My light's draining. Start slowly walking back out. Yeah. See or hear anything. Guys, if y'all see anything, I got it on night vision, but my light's slowly starting to die. 
Dude, I can see my breath and I'm sweating. It's hot out here. Oh, same here. They can see it on my camera. You can see your breath. Yeah, I can see mine too. It's hot. It's like 80 degrees maybe. Yeah, I'm sweating right now and it's, you can see your breath. That's what's crazy. This is a big hill to go up too. It's steep, yeah. I thought I saw something over there. It's just eerily quiet out here. Yes. And the fact that we're the brightest things out here, I wonder if anything can wa is watching us. That's always the scary part about being remote like this. Out here with these lights. What sees us? Because it blinds us from seeing anything else. Yeah. My light's already dying again. I've not had them in here but 10 minutes. I put a new battery in mine when we got here. Something's over there. It's disturbing those birds. Hello? Oh, the shadow of your light through that tree blade there it scared the crap out of me up there. This is just an eerie cemetery. Shine your light up the hill. Yeah. It's not doing much. No, mine ain't either. My light's about dead. I feel like if I turned my light off, it wouldn't make much of a difference. This place freaks me out. And I've been to several cemeteries, and this place freaks me out. Shh. Hello? I just heard something back behind me here. You know what's messed up? What? I can't see my breath anymore. No. Like literally cannot see my breath anymore. That was so weird, man. I keep hearing something down here. What the hell? Was that an animal or what? Whatever it was, it was either big or far. Because that carried. Let's start making way to the car, man. That was like a, oh. Yeah. As if you heard that, comment down below. I know I got your key. Shine your light that way. Yours is brighter. See the tree that's going like a V with the middle one? Yeah. It looked like there was something between those. I barely can see them on my camera right now. So like my camera? Right yeah. here between those trees. It yeah, looked like there right was here. something right there. Yep. Oh, when I do that, it gives more lighting back here. Dude, that was weird. All right, car looks like a good destination. It does, it's right up ahead. Okay, I just heard something move over. I think we got a visitor, man. And my light is dying yeah, I can ever see so rapidly. Before, I can barely see him now. We need to get to the car. I got a bad feeling. All right, guys. I might watch here and turn the light down just a hair. I hope they don't trip over nothing. 
Guys, I love you. I'm getting out of here. This place is really starting to stretch me out. Big shout out to John. Till next time, guys. We love you. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. We're going to get out of here. This has been a cool spot, but huge shout out to Tim. I just, I have a bad feeling. I, nothing crazy is happening, but I really have a bad feeling that I need to get out of here. So I'm not running off, but I am taking my internal advice and getting out of here. Oh, oh yeah, my light is, uh, I got a little bit left, but. There it goes again. It's over here now. It was this way. Yeah. All right, let's get out of here. It's on the other side of it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I love y'all. Peace.